Maybe time to go to work. She wants to go outside. We have to do your work first. How much garbage do we make? Good work. I have an audience today. What? You have an audience? Yep, yeah, and mom's special birthday today. Happy yeah. birthday. Right, Daniel? Yes. All right. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, Daniel. Bye. Have a great day. Bye. Well, it is a another nice day here in Wisconsin. Tomorrow it's supposed to be close to 70 degrees, which is just crazy. It's still the middle of winter. Um, so we're going to take advantage of that weather tomorrow, actually the rest of the week. I'm going to have Carlito come in. I talked to him yesterday and I really need a retaining wall right here. It's just too steep. Um, it's going to be impossible to mow even if I do get grass to grow there. So I was thinking maybe like from here, put a retaining wall around this corner and then where the landscape kind of fades and blends back down stop it right about there and then behind the wall I was thinking maybe like a two or three foot like planting area with mulch and some flowers just to make it look a little nicer around here I mean it doesn't look good the only flowers I have are up there that little planter right by the, the porch that's it but today I'm gonna meet up with Eric and Francisco. I had Tino come in and he did come in and he left right away because he had an issue at home that he had to take care of. So it's just gonna be Francisco, Eric and myself. And they went and salted last Friday for me. It snowed a little bit, it snowed about an inch, a little less than an inch. And unfortunately, I don't know, if, I think it was probably Eric, I don't know. I told him to salt heavy um, because there was like three quarters of an inch, maybe half an inch, and it was blowing, so some of the pavement was bare and so forth. I said this, to just salt heavy, it'll take care of it, but he put down uh, a crazy amount of salt, like way, 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 way too much. So the condos called and complained immediately, and then yesterday I drove by there to look at it, and there's a lot. So I'm gonna have those guys sweep and blow all the salt, pick up all the extra salt. Uh, we got to do that right away and then I'm gonna go continue getting some of the building materials continue stocking up for um, you know the season which is gonna begin and and not too long so uh, Schmitz is only open on Monday so there's certain things I need from them I'm gonna head over there get some uh, at least order some rebar get some felt and a few other things so we'll work on that today and see what happens all right just pulled up to the gym I got a good half an hour I can spend here last week was not a good week I didn't work out as much and I ate way worse last week ever since best mom Wednesday things did not go good but we're gonna get back on track this week all right just got my workout in I did it's a Monday so I did chest and triceps I text Ray when I was in there big Ray and he's gonna come in at 9 30 so I'm gonna take Francisco and Eric show them what to do at the condos come back meet up with big ray and then uh we're gonna go pick some stuff up we got to bring the form truck to the winter shop so nate the great can start working on that towards the end of the week as well so i'll see you guys over at the coffee shop which is literally right behind me you can see it right there gym is right here coffee shop's right there works out real good and my shop is like two blocks that way or my yard i should say soon to be shop hopefully man i love mondays going to the gym after the weekend and eating some more carbs you get a nice pump feel like a big old monster for like 30 minutes and then you feel weak again i'm gonna go super low carbs this week all week long try to make up for all the stuff i ate last week morning morning good she's the dealer the dealer of junk food good how are you doing all right it's my wife's birthday today Big day. All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. So but I don't know what to get her though. You so got any? You got any ideas for me? But Christmas is for jewels, right? Well, she has she has a lot of jewelry. Yep. Okay. Now but you I, ain't recording me because she can't find out. Before no, you. no, no. Okay. Making sure. Get her a bouquet of flowers. Flowers. Got it. Mm-hmm. And then give her a gift card. To her favorite dress shop. Okay, I can do that. And I would 
<laughs> What's up? I was like, who's this guy behind me? I'm gonna knock him out. <laughs> How's it going, man? Hey, just pick me up. I get the from here. Oh, wow. Oh, this your crew? No, well, yeah, kind of. He's old crew, old school okay. crew. Okay. From way back in the day. That's gonna take me a long time to get home, so he's just picking me up right now. Oh, okay. Yep, see you, see you later. Bye, All right, good to see you again, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah I texted her a little, you know, a little thing where it makes confetti. I thought that was enough for today. No. <laughs> no. Y'all been together how long? <laughs> to, uh, almost 24 years. See, yeah. no, it definitely not enough. S so no text message emojis? I mean, that is just the beginning. beginning. Gotcha. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey, you could be a marriage counselor. <laughs> Have a great day. You too. See you next time. All right. Oh, hi, how are you? I'm great, how are you? All right, see you later. Yep, thank you. All right, let's go meet up with Eric and Francisco. They need street brooms, blower, shovel. I'm gonna have them take the little dump truck. They can just shovel the salt right back up into that thing. And that should be it. They just have a lot of sweeping and blowing and shoveling to do. Between knocking the mailbox over, hitting the garage, and then this, I am uh, I'm not feeling good about my chances of getting the contract again next year. We'll put it that way. Not feeling good about it at all. I've never had this many complaints ever in one season. I'm quite certain I'm going to get fired from there. This will probably be my last season plowing that place, which is sad. But, you know, that's just what happens, I guess. Plus, next winter, I'm, I'm going to have those... I'm quite certain I'm gonna have those joiners on the market. I'm gonna get those going. And I might do some traveling around with those, might do some shows with those. So I'm probably gonna need extra time anyhow. So it might not be the worst thing in the world. As long as I'm with DeWalt, I'm not gonna, you know, put my joiners on the market, obviously, because they may or may not have their own kind of joiner like that in the works. I have no idea. So far they don't, um, but I'm not gonna, you know, it's that they, that would be kind of awkward, if you know what I'm saying. So I'm going to wait until um, fall when our contract expires um, to launch. And that will work out good because that will give me all season to test the joiner and just make sure it's perfect and everything I'm hoping it's going to be. And again, I'm still open to working with somebody else, you know, partnering or whatever with a bigger company. But we'll see how that goes. That's not easy either. Well, I took a couple bites of the egg, and they are absolutely terrible. They're old. They're not rotten, but you can just tell they're all dry and they're old. 903, just pulling into the yard, and Eric and Francisco are both here. And you guys saw Tino at the gas station just leaving. So that guy he was with, Jose, he used to work for me years ago. He worked for me for years, actually. It's a beautiful day. It's 40 degrees already gorgeous 2024 i heard a couple of people say they heard it on the news that this is going to be the warmest winter that we've ever had in wisconsin which i completely believe this has been unreal i mean unbelievable gorgeous gorgeous weather i'm gonna cut that up for blocking we'll lay that down on this concrete i'm gonna see if schmitz will deliver the rebar it would be a lot easier than putting it on that because then we gotta mess around with it. They have a flatbed, they can put it right here, dump it off. I can take forks, just plop it right on the wood. So they used to do that. I'm gonna see if they still do get a big stock of rebar right here. That'll be nice. Big Ray and I will take this up to the winter shop today. Why are you walking like that, Eric? When I took the salter, I slipped. You hit yourself where? Right here. Oh, like, oh, oh more. It hurts really bad. I'm in muscle cream. But it's because I put like this. Muscle cream's not going to help you, Eric. <laughs> you got to have muscles for that. Muscle <laughs> 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 fat. You need that fat cream. The fat cream. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have you guys take that truck. Okay. You're gonna need a couple shovels, a street broom, blower, hammer. You gotta go to the condos. You put so much salt on the driveways. <laughs> it's so bad, Eric. 
They were complaining right away. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. You gotta get. You gotta pick up all the salt on all the driveways. Okay. I'll go over there and I'll show you. You can't blow it on the grass, dude. Okay. Yeah. Actually, the salt that's on the grass, you gotta blow it in, okay. Okay. and then blow it down and sweep it into a pile in each driveway and just shovel it into the salter. It's really, really bad. I would drove by there yesterday and there was one guy hosing all the salt off his driveway and another guy was sweeping. <laughs> I was like, oh man. Use a gas blower because there's there's a lot. You're gonna be running it for a long time. Yeah. Electric or the battery power blowers are okay, but not for a long, long time like that. Oh, I got the TV. Yeah, you guys didn't even see this. Look at this now. Yo, you can see better. Oh, yeah, way that's better nice. now. Yeah, that's, that's way better really, now. Really nice. Yeah, it's really clear now. It's really clear. Oh, bring a hammer too. You guys got um, all the sticks that are falling over, pound them back in nice. And then the hunks of mud, hunks of sod, like put them back in their spot where they came from. We gotta get it nice over there. I'm afraid, I'm afraid I ain't gonna get hired over there again next year. I'll meet you over there real quick. I ain't staying there, I'll just show you real quick. That's a lot of salt. It's gonna snow tomorrow. <laughs> it could, like, it could snow a foot and it would just melt right off. So when you do this, um, blow the salt off the grass too. Cause you sprayed it like, you know, what's this? No way. This is special Texas edition. <laughs> it is. Look. No way, right? Yeah, this is worth money. Yeah. This is worth uh this is worth 25 cents. <laughs> Did you good. just turn it on and just take a nap right here? <laughs> <laughs> no. took a nap. That guy, that guy washed all his drive. He washed all the salt off know. yesterday. He was out here with a hose and he was not looking happy. So you gotta do all the driveways, man. Okay. You don't have to worry about the sidewalks, those are okay. But yeah, get all this cleaned off. But yeah, like look at look at those, man. See, she washed her upper deck too, or swept it. People were out here sweeping yesterday. I felt so bad. I drove by and I was like this, like I don't want <laughs> I don't want them to see me, Eric. I gotta go meet Big Ray right now. He's waiting for me. Okay. So you guys will be busy for a while. Don't forget to get all the sticks back, like all the ones that are tipping, like yeah. like tip them nice and put put them back in. Yeah, and then any big chunks of sod, just put them back where they came from. Am I supposed to meet you at the yard, or? Yeah, I'm. I'm showing Eric and Francisco what to do. I'll be there in like ten minutes. Yeah, I'm looking to get an estimate for some concrete work at my home. Uh, okay. Where do you live, and what type of work did you have in mind? Man, look at that. Oh man. <laughs> look at that. That is. That's a lot of salt. So now they got to clean it up though. So that's probably the last time he'll do that. That guy swept his whole driveway yesterday. I saw him. I guess that's how you learn though. I got to get gas. I'm eight miles to empty. This is uh, as close to empty as I've ever been in this truck. So I had another call this morning as well. A guy wants a patio in Brookfield, which is perfect. That's right where I live. And it's a referral. And referrals are great because you already have one foot in the door. As long as your price is decent, you're more than likely gonna get the job. And he told me the size of the patio and an estimate that he already had the price. And it was high, it was really high. Like they didn't want the job for some reason. So pretty good chance I'll pick that patio up too. I just gotta text him back and set up an appointment. Sales are coming in, leads, everything's looking really good for the season. I'm feeling really good about everything right now. Okay, made it to the gas station. Five miles to empty. This truck is so filthy, I need to wash this thing. So bad. We're gonna run over to storage real quick. Drop off this uh, this food. I bought a food supply. I think I got it from, man, I don't even remember the website. Let me see if it, if it says on here, ready our, readyhour.com. I don't know, but I bought a whole bunch of food. It lasts for, for a super long time so i just thought it was a good idea i'm not a prepper or anything i don't get carried away with that stuff like some people do i don't have anything against you if you do it's just that's not me so try to get prepared a little bit not be dumb about things but not go overboard at the same time scary world we live in right now very scary all right i am back and big ray is here What's up? How we doing? You're getting bigger, Ray. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna have to re-nickname you Bigger Bigger Ray. Bigger Ray. <laughs> what happened? Are you eating too much? I'm eating too much. Oh man. 
actually just gonna have you take the form truck to the winter shop to start. Okay. Hopefully she starts up. Nate, Nate the Great fixed it, so I should be fine now. He's coming back later this week to work on it. I might have to jump it again. We'll see how the batteries did. See? Like nothing. All right. Let it warm up for like a good five minutes. We'll put this away in the meanwhile. We'll do this first. I lost my GoPro. My Well, I have obviously several. I lost one of my GoPros. What's going on here? Why are they back already? Why are you back already? I told you to make sure you got a hammer three times. Oh, come on. All right, just pulling into the winter shop. The mud is actually drying up a little bit. That's kind of nice. I'm gonna get this door open so Big Ray can pull in. I think it'll be able to fit in there, even with a dually in there. Uh, yeah, I'll just pull this truck up a little bit more and then he can pull right in. You know what I should do? I should pull this one out. Man, I totally forgot about ordering the, the bulbs for the headlights. I completely forgot about it. All weekend and I didn't order a single thing. <laughs> I can't move this thing. It's got no batteries in it. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, we'll just leave that truck outside the door. Found my camera. I thought it might be up here. All right, I got a call from Bulgaria. That's a first. Victory, this is Ryan. Easy money. Very easy. What's up, Mr. Ryan? Oh, not much. Where are you from? I'm from Bulgaria. Do you know where this is? Uh, yeah, I know where Bulgaria is. Okay. Uh, I just want uh, to thank you for all the clips. I'm a huge fan. Well, thank you. I, I really appreciate, appreciate it. Are you a construction worker? I'm an electrical fitter, yeah. Oh, okay, nice. Very nice. Uh, I'm with Big Ray right now. Oh, what's up, Big Ray? How's it going? <laughs> Thank uh, you so much for answering me. All right, have a great day. That's the first call I ever got from Paul. Oh, Gary. Yeah. All right, that thing is good enough for now. Man, I do not like picking out cards. Most of them are so dumb. I don't like cards that say too much because usually it just says stuff that you would never say and your wife knows it so it just seems really fake I like cards that don't say a lot that's way too much already oh way too much I like you more than bacon my wife would not even smile if she saw that man there's hardly any for a wife Snoopy I don't think so so now I'm forced to settle because there's hardly any for a wife. Maybe I'll get her the bacon one. <laughs> I do that sometimes when I'm 40, almost 47. Man, that kid's having a full blown temper tantrum. <laughs> These cars are terrible. These are terrible cars. See, now I'm settling for a card that I don't like. What are you gonna do? Man, that kid was having a tantrum in there. What kid? Oh, you weren't in there? You must have no. walked out before that. Mm -mm. Those cards are terrible. What cards? Birthday cards, just yeah. all junk. <laughs> I don't even like the one that I bought. Why did you buy? It's the best one I could <laughs> find. What am I gonna do? Okay, we're back at Schmidt's. And they're open, so. I want to grab some felt and talk to them about the rebar. What can I do for you? Um, I want to get some felt and then you guys deliver the rebar, whole bundle. Uh, it takes a little bit of lead time because we'd run through gator trucking and have to line up their flatbed. You guys don't have your flatbed? You used to use a flatbed here. Not, we don't. It runs through gator. Okay. The only thing I have is that 12 foot bed on the steak truck. Yeah. All right. That's okay. Um, we'll skip the rebar. I got another idea. 
for a rebar. Um, let's do felt, just two, give me two bales of the four inch by half inch, one bale of the quarter inch by four inch. Well, you know, I'm looking for the foam felt, right? The rolls. Okay, I thought your felt, not the foam. Oh, that's a, that's foam expansion felt, yeah. Oh, okay, foam. Yeah, the foam bales, the, gotcha. the okay. yeah. Probably have those inside, I would imagine, somewhere. There's a bunch of them right there. And he might have put some in the other building too, right? Everything on the foam is here. And on the floor, this is I it. Think I've got half. I've got five here. Oh, you guys are really low. Yeah, that we are. Yeah, that's the quarter, and this is all five inch. Yep, that is. All right. So we're not, we're, we're hey, you guys are not ready for the season. Well, the season's not for another month. We're just in a weird time. <laughs> a month's not that long from now. All right, thank you. All right, we're going across the street again. I was going to buy everything from here, but I don't think Z's has the foam felt either. We're going to go check. I know he'll deliver it for me, though. Oh, that's good. The rebar? I've been here. You've never been here? Oh. Wow. Don't look like they have much rebar though. <laughs> At all. They got like one bundle. Oh no, they got another one under there. How much is your rebar? Can you compete with the big boys? You guys good price or too expensive? Tell me the truth. <laughs> what size? Three eighths. Three eighths? It's like uh like So that's the only bundle you have right there. I got an open bundle and yeah, this one here. That one there. What do you have for foam felt? You got four? Four inch? Three, four, five. Where's the four? Six. You don't have any of the quarter in Oh, you do have quarter by four. Yep. <laughs> See? I told you they'd have it. Well, I thought they would have it. So we're gonna take we're gonna take um one of these and one of these. I think we'll take two of these actually. We'll and take another four. Yep. Yep. One can maybe go in the back seat too. We'll see. Put that one right here. And then one in the back seat. Could you wire wheel them though? There's a little rust on them. What? <laughs> you want me to pay? I could pay now for this stuff. Yeah, I could pay for everything. I don't care. Johnsonville. Lunch. Yeah. <laughs> Look at you eyeing up the Johnsonville sausage, summer sausage. You got something back out of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was worth it. I feel bad, you know. Schmitz is losing out on a lot of business, but oh, really? they don't have what I need. They're not open. But get with the program, man. I spent almost almost six thousand dollars here that I would have spent over there in the last couple of days. That's sad. I would cry about Schmitz. Well, they don't. That's nothing for them, but it's something. Man, that's something, something is something. <laughs> we got to put the felt in yep. here. So I want to stock two of these shelves, like to the brim, and then yeah. like whatever extra we have, we'll keep in that other bigger shed next door. Stock this with the half inch, like as much as you can fit, and then put the quarter inch here. This is only enough fell for the first job. It's a big one. Oh, man. For real? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna make an area, probably that shelf, for all my sealer stuff. Make a little. So when I come in to go seal, I just have everything ready to go. It says it's unbreakable. No way. You want to bet? It's unbreakable, huh? Let's find out. <laughs> yeah, oh, we can break it. <laughs> we can definitely break it. But this goes with my vice. It's really light though, man. This is the block heater. Why is it still plugged into the extension cord? Block heater for? Probably the machine that's at the old yard. Oh, man. That doesn't make sense. It's not good. Somebody just, instead of going like this, somebody just went like this and pulled the whole thing out. I gotta check that out, man. That's not cool. Yeah. Or, or it's the one that's at the church. It's probably the one that was at the church. Oh man. Poor guy with his, with his chipper truck. He's busted. They're gonna find stuff wrong with his truck. Oh, they got the creeper out. The cops pull the creeper out, you're done. They're looking under the truck and everything. They're doing a full DOT inspection on that thing. Two, not one. They're coming hard. We better check. I'm almost positive it's from the skid loader at the church. Somebody just pulled the whole thing out. Hello? Hello? Yeah? Uh, we are just, uh... You're about to finish? 
He said you were an idiot? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, man. Because <laughs> he was like, whoever did this is an idiot. <laughs> hey, was it the... Uh, <laughs> we sent another guy to do it, so... Oh, so you... Oh, okay. So you guys pretty much blame Big Ray. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you guys. <laughs> we sent another guy. Oh, another guy yeah. is me. <laughs> Eric was like, yeah, somebody else did it. Or Tino. Um, I'll, see you, I'll see you in a minute. Bye. They Blames call, me they again. Call, <laughs> <laughs> that's not even me. <laughs> that's funny. They call him an idiot. Right, he was and, and Eric told he him it was me. somebody else. <laughs> he didn't want to take the heat. Yeah, no, yeah come on. <laughs> there. There's sticks laying here. They didn't even pick these up. That one needs to be pulled out. That one needs to be pulled out. That one needs to be straightened. <laughs> Did they even get these? It don't look like they got some of these. Uh, there's still a bunch of sticks and stuff that are all laying over. Yeah, we're gonna get, yeah, we're gonna get those out. And that driveway there didn't get done at all. What driveway? Around the corner. But yeah, clean up the sticks. They probably got a full hopper of salt again. It's off to the top. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, that was like salt overload, man. That was crazy. I never seen that much salt. All right. I'm pretty sure they pulled it right out of this one. No, this one. Yep, I don't see no plug. Go grab the go grab the end. Bring it over here. It plugs in right here. How you wouldn't notice that though? I don't know. When you pull the end out and the whole thing comes along with it. Yep. Fixed it. I'm gonna go to 52s and then I wanna take this over to the winter shop. Okay. So I'll meet you at 52s. Okay. Eric's gonna buy us lunch. I ain't buying you no lunch, Eric. You might as well just have your little sandwich. I gotta get something to eat real quick though. I'm so hungry. I'm gonna just throw that in. Okay. <laughs> that was a lot of things. You told me heavy. Eric, there's okay. a difference between heavy and a whole hopper on each driveway. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make sure nobody falls. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. He's backing in each driveway and falling asleep. It didn't seem like it was going. Oh, it was going, Eric. It was going. I'll take a gyro with no pita. Let me get a, a grilled chicken sandwich. Oh, you ain't gonna eat this pickle? Are you crazy? Pickles are good, man. Thank you. See you later. Uh, go to the winter shop. We gotta get that salt out of there. Rinse it off. Concrete driveway in New Berlin. Previous customers. Yes, sir. That happens though. You'll do somebody's patio and it's like, man, that was hardly worth it. I didn't make that much money. And then they call you next year and they want a whole driveway, you know? That's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's worth taking smaller jobs video the most me and big ray been arguing who could I, eat the most oh okay i thought you meant like fast like who could eat fast no not fast like the most okay the most i don't know maybe i, I think i can beat you right we gotta see this <laughs> i think i can this. beat we you gotta do that. i don't think so yeah i think i got you on this one not a chance uh, brother you know, i can eat a lot let's, let's i can go. eat a lot <laughs> i would like to see this <laughs> i like to see this too <laughs> if you guys want to see me versus big ray who can eat the most Leave a comment down below. Ray, Ray, he would go down in flames. <laughs> I can eat. Let's try it. I don't know about that. <laughs> well, I think we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. But what are we gonna eat though? See, that's the thing. Like, I, I can't. I, Something I can't. we both enjoy. Okay, good. Cause you know. Yeah, like whatever. Tacos. Or Gotta be fair. Cause whatever. I can't eat hot dogs. I get ahead. Oh, I don't want hot dogs. <laughs> I want to eat something good. I'm gonna go get trained. I'm about to go get trained. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go get trained. I'm gonna go. Have you know who Joey Chestnut is? I don't know who Joey is. Chestnut. I'll pay him and he will train me. Oh, he's the most famous hot dog eating contest champion oh ever. Goodness, I, I think he went on Mr. Beast channel once, yeah. And he ate, I think, oh, it, that guy, I, know I think it was yeah. like the biggest pizza in the world. I, I saw that one, yeah. And it was four yeah. regular guys versus him, and he ate the whole pizza by himself. Yeah, I saw that one. That was, that was, that that was, was outrageous. That was awesome. We should do that. The most put the most in your belly. I'm gonna die and watch. <laughs> I'm gonna just drop dead right there. <laughs> <laughs> just be like, I gotta uh, beat him. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem because I'm really competitive, so I'll probably eat. That's it. why what happened to me. I'll I think we, what if we go to the hospital and get pumped? In. <laughs> <laughs> we we both have to go get pumped right away. <laughs> that, that that would be the. Did best. I win? <laughs> 
As long as that one. No, hey, we one more. After, we get one more. <laughs> after they pumped us, they'd have to weigh the contents. And yeah. then, <laughs> sorry guys, it was a tie. They're oh, like, no. no! <laughs> I might not tell my wife about this. She <laughs> might not let me do it. <laughs> She's gonna be like, no, you're gonna die. That would be funny. That would be the best video ever. Yeah, if we had to go to the hospital. <laughs> we are gonna be eating, we're gonna be sweating too. Yeah, this is really happen. bad. Your whole forehead's gonna be shiny. <laughs> and tell then, oh, she has to record. <laughs> she has to record. <laughs> you know what would be really disgusting? As much shrimp cocktail as you could eat. Oh my Ooh, imagine I, imagine e overeating shrimp Whoa. and then throwing that up. We'll throw it up. Ooh, it would come out in that red stream. That would be really bad for my diet. Yeah. It's only one meal though. I'll just save up like three weeks of cheap meals. I'm gonna text these guys. I got like inside connections at Allen. Like really, really inside connections at Allen. I'm gonna text them right now and see if they're interested in giving me a really good deal on a new buggy. I think I made up my mind. I, I just need to buy another new buggy for the rental fleet. See, he texted me at World of Concrete. They wanted me to come over and talk to them, but I did. Almost, Big Ray. Almost. Yeah, almost. A little bit more, he got I did it. One time, one hand. You did? On my video. One handed? Yeah, I was like, yush, and I did it. No way. I did. I Let did. me see. I went like this. I went. Go ahead, one handed. Oh, wow. Can I do it? Yeah. <laughs> if you could do it, I could do it. I know that. I know you ain't stronger than my shoulders. Oh, you went way down. Yeah, I went down. Give me a push. Oh. Oh, my. <laughs> get your chance. Get your chance. Oh, I can get it. You went way down. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I did. Got it. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> When they're washing that, I'm gonna order this right now. Get it all coming on Amazon. Did you shovel salt back into the salter? Yeah, there's a lot. There is? Uh, hey, go back up into the corner somewhere over there and dump all the salt out. Like way in the corner over there. Just go in circles. Cause then you can wash the whole yeah. thing out. I just text the guys and s see if they wanna sell me another power buggy. And then we can rent that one and then we'll have ourselves a brand new one. You gotta wash it good this year, Ray. Yeah, I gotta wash yeah. it Yeah, I'm gonna order them right now. Okay, first I'm gonna get the clips. They got different kinds of clips. I don't think they make a 20, I'm not positive though. Let me just see one, cause they're all, they're like a little different. Dude, I love Amazon. You just do this, man, what do you got? You just prime, that's it, done. Place your order. You hit the button twice and you're done. It'll be here tomorrow, just like that fast, dude. I love Amazon, I love it. And then they just send you email, thanks for shopping with us. Yep. And then tomorrow it'll show up. So I'm gonna take these out. I'm gonna, I might as well just replace these bulbs. Yeah, I'm just gonna get these two, get the LLs. Then I won't have to replace them for a long time. Yeah. The three thirty-one fifty-seven Ks. And I don't know about this peanut bulb. It doesn't have any numbers. Oh man. Okay. Actually, if I'm gonna go to Napa, I'm just gonna get both of these at Napa. Yeah. I'm already gonna be there. I'm just gonna order the headlights. What are, what? what are you doing with that? Where did this come from, man? You Eric? tell me. Tino said he, he beat up a, a... Where did this come from? He said he went to go poop over there, and then he found it. No way. Yeah. He said that's a real... Form. Yeah, no, this is real. This is a shed. He's got big bucks around here. He doesn't even know. That's, that's crazy, dude. Over there? Right there? Yeah, it's a shed. this he is a shed. There was a, there was a bigger one, but he couldn't that's pick it up. That's a young, healthy buck right there. Really? Yeah, he, there was another one? Yeah, he's, he's, Where do you go poopity doopity? He's gonna run over there in those woods. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go look, man. Yeah, well, That's a there. nice buck. I know I gotta be careful for the poop. Yeah, We're either gonna find the poop or the shed. <laughs> one of the two. He said there was a bigger one. Yeah. No kidding. That's yeah. crazy. That's crazy, dude. Well, That's a nice buck. Was, That's like a 125 right there. Was, oh my. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> and it's still it is going. Still going. How, yeah. Is it empty now? No, it's still a little, little bit more than that's put, a lot put the salt. vibrator on. I did hit a couple times. Did it again, please? Yeah. Do you know where Tino poops over here? No, why? Because he found like a big antler dude from a buck. And he said there was a oh, bigger one. Oh, I he said he's, Tino, Tino's got a spot over here. Yeah, yeah he's got a spot. He got, he got a beer. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask Tino when he comes back. 
We ain't never gonna find nothing. Not a chance. It's still not empty? Yeah. Almost. It's a nice buck, man. Look at that, it's all bladed out right there. I mean, if you count this as a point, that's seven on one side. This one got busted off. But if that was out here, that's a beautiful buck. So it looks like there's an LED conversion kit. Compare this to your factory halogens that put out 1,200 lumens. These are three times brighter. You found a bunch of poop and doopies over there. You did? Yeah. You found his... I didn't see the thing, but, though. But you found where he went? I saw a lot of poop. He uh, followed the poop, like he followed the steps. <laughs> our unique aluminum thin radiators encourage optimum cooling of our units so they can last a lifetime. This is not round. This looks like it's round, but they don't show the other side. Dude, I'm gonna go to AutoZone or like Napa or something and just... Just some double checks? Maybe they got them right there. I could just yeah. get everything today. That'll be nice having nice bright headlights on there. Cause those headlights are the worst. All right, I think we're done here. I still gotta go get my wife a gift. Oh, nice. Diamonds. Chain? Nah, she only has little chains. Well, you gotta go get a cute ring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a big fat one. She would hate that. Hey, when you're done, just, just close and lock all this up. Yeah, and then uh, I'll text you tonight. All right, see you. We're here to Fleet Farm, one of my favorite stores. We're gonna see if they have these balls. Let me grab them, I forgot them. I think they're gonna have everything we need. Pow, here we go. We gotta find these. These gotta be the 9,007. Those are the 9,005. Seven. Yep. These should be them right here. Oh, and man, they got all kinds of big ray. I know. You could get anything here. Oh. Cobalt blue nano coating for whiter light. 100% street legal. This is just a 3157. What year? 3157. Pow. Silver stars. Oh, yeah, right here. 194s. Oh, Pow. Line those up and see. The socket. The socket. Is right. it? Like the width. I mean, they look the same, man. They do? They do, but. It's okay. One way to find out. Oh yeah, that's definitely the same. So we got those two. Now just the headlights. I think they're illegal. Yeah, because look what it says. Power sports or fog use only. Oh, they're too bright. Yeah. Man, these are them right here. There you go. So there these you are forty-five dollars. Well, these are exactly the same. Twenty bucks. That's yeah, exactly those the are the basics. Yeah, these are look at look at that. They're yeah, literally literally, literally the, same. the same. Even more. These are even more expensive. But these are charged with xenon. Whatever that so, is. Xenon, baby. Yeah. You know, we gotta, we <laughs> gotta get xenon. the xenon. These are the 9,007s. So you either go low, medium, or high, or illegal. No, these are low, <laughs> medium, high, super high, and super illegal. There you go. You can't use the LEDs for the road. It says That's right crazy. there, it's not even legal for the road. They better be bright, man. These better be good, $75 compared to 20. Yeah, right. So it better be way better. Thank you. Thank you, machine. Now we gotta say thank you to the machines. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The world's changing, Big Ray. Why do the guys leave the plow up again, man? Put the plow down. Right. Always put the plow down when you park. Yep, all right, I'll see you later. Yep, thanks for your help today. All right, I'm gonna go put that plow down. And then I called my wife and I told her for her birthday that she would like it if I just picked up some Papa Murphy's pizzas so she didn't have to cook dinner. She seemed pretty excited about that. So we're gonna go grab some pizzas. I still haven't got, bought her anything for her birthday yet. I don't know what to get her. Guys, if you watch this video, put the plow down every time you park. Okay, what a beautiful day. We'll go get those pizzas. And then I'll uh, try to think of something for my wife. Papa Murphy's pizza. We enjoy it. I don't know, I think it's a national franchise. Do they have Papa Murphy's by you? I would assume so, but it's pretty good. Usually we'll get it for special occasions, birthdays and so forth. All right, there you have it. Two beautiful pizzas, you just pop them in your oven and you're good to go. Cheese, sausage, mushroom, onion, that's my favorite pizza. And then the kids just get cheese and sausage. So I just got a call from the machine shop that's making my joiners and they have some questions and I need to go there. So I'm going back to where I just came from, Germantown. So I wanna keep those guys moving. So I told them I'll be right there, man. I just wanna, you know, speed up the process as quickly as possible. Shout out to Cider Heating, Plumbing, Electrical. Guy just was honking at me, gave me the thumbs up. So we'll give him a shout out. 
just about back to the machine shop I guess there's an issue with the width of something and the radius that I want to make the joiner it's not gonna work so we got to figure something else out there's a lot of little stuff you know when you make something you just don't really think about it until you're actually making it where you discover you know that's not gonna work what you thought but we're gonna get it all dialed in okay I just pulled up to the house and I met with the machine shop guys and we got that all figured out and we're gonna make some changes I got the pizzas in the back here I'm gonna drop them off and then I'm gonna run up to uh, like pick and save it's one of our local grocery stores and uh, pick up like some dessert or something and maybe get my wife a balloon or whatever for her birthday and I still haven't bought her anything I just don't know what to buy her I just don't know I mean I could run to the jewelry store but I don't even know what to get her seems like seems like I've bought her everything already I don't know man maybe I'll just listen to Miss Z and and get her a gift card oh yeah grocery store we're gonna listen to Miss Z and get some flowers these are pretty nice man I'm not good at picking out flowers I don't even know Like, did these flowers already bloom and they're done, or are they about to bloom? I don't know. I think they're about to bloom. That one's definitely about to bloom. I think this one. That's only $15? That's pretty cheap. I think we'll get her this one. That's really nice, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. It's for my wife. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, wow. How much is it? It's only $15. Yeah, it's a good deal. Oh, yeah, I think so. Happy yeah. Have a good night. You too. Go big or go home. That's what I say. Now, if I beat her home, she went to go pick up the kids from school, I can put this at her spot before she gets home. Come on. Oh, it's closed. They're all closed. Close, 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 close. They're all closed. All right. That's a giant balloon. Yeah. I think instead of a cake, I'm gonna go to Quick Trip and get her donuts. The kids really like donuts. So I think I'll get donuts. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh yeah. Right in there. Perfect. All right, I beat my wife home, but she should be home any minute. Grab her card, and then she'll be surprised. Got it, and I beat her. Quick trip again, third time today. Man. How you doing, man? Good. How are you? <laughs> Thank you. Have a great day. All right. See you next time. Look at those donuts. Man, I'm not eating any of them, but they sure do look good. I can't eat the pizza either. Okay, I just pulled up in the driveway. I got the donuts. I got the balloons, the flowers, the card, the pizza. So I think I'm good for today. And what I'm going to do, I decided, is buy myself a little bit of time. Don't tell me that you guys have never done this before. I know that you have. So we have a date night plan on Friday. Today is a Monday, and we're going to the auto show. So what I'm going to tell my wife is that I'll have her gift by Friday and I'll give it to her when we're on our date. So I think we're really good. All right, I guess that's it for today. Tomorrow you guys are gonna see Carlito. Um, I think we're just gonna excavate along the side of my driveway for the wall. Wednesday morning, unfortunately, it's supposed to snow. So it's supposed to be about 70 tomorrow and then snow on Wednesday, be super cold, back to warm on Thursday and Friday. So my goal, I guess, is just to get the wall done by the end of the week. Um, so tomorrow maybe we'll just excavate and I have a bunch of other stuff to do as well I want to get those headlights all in on the f-350 uh, I'm gonna have some of the guys come in it should be another fun day all right well I'll see you guys on the next one adios I know hi how's your day some things were good some things were bad oh man I know what that's like every day whoa hi Grace hi Annie hello Annie 
Where's mom? She's out there talking to our friend. She's in the van? Yes. Did she come in yet? No. She didn't even see this yet? And she'll be surprised? 580 calories for one donut. Man. There's been days, no kidding, like customers will bring us donuts and I will eat like four. I ain't kidding. I know you guys have eaten four too. Have you ever have you ever eaten four donuts in one time? No, that's mom said that's too much for you. Oh. <laughs> or something. I was like, I want to buy one. <laughs> and I was like, is that for the bottle? <laughs> for the soup? Mm -hmm. And I thought it was pizza in here when you bring it. <laughs> no. That's not pizza. I was thinking on the way home too, and I decided what I'm gonna get my wife. I'm gonna get her her very own, well, I guess I can't say it. So I I have a bunch of them, but she doesn't have one of her own. I'm gonna get her a, some of you guys will pick this up, some of you won't, I can't really talk about it, a, or a, if it's not too big something that's you know like with a pink grip or something something more feminine so i think that'll be good for her. i have a ton of them but she doesn't have any of her own so i think she'll feel special she has one of her very own huh she only can have three three yeah because diana said four is a lot of cowards that's two more cowards <laughs> well, okay just give her two then we don't want her to get too plumpy <laughs> Give her the treats. Tender fills, grilled salmon flavor. Whoa! That's for mom. <laughs> That's for mom. <laughs> Let me see. Where's wow. Mom, mom didn't even see it yet because oh, she's she? been sitting in her car talking for her like her a friend. long time talking on the phone. Yep. Grace she said, ta-da. Ta-da. <laughs> what? <laughs> what in the that world? Is huge. Ian, is the biggest balloon I've ever seen. Hey. Yeah, it's for you. Can you come here? So good. Wow, we're going to see those. Oh. <laughs> oh. Those birds. Oh, my gosh. 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 Oh, my g